before we head off to bed here, we did hit 100 comments, well, well over 100 comments on the last video, so we're gonna pull another name out of the hat. <laughs> <laughs> How y'all doing today? Y'all having a good one so far? I guess it's early. We start every day here at 6 in the morning, so if you jump in right in the morning with us, well, congratulations for getting a good start in your day. We are headed down to none other than Freedom Breeder to visit our Freedom Breeder family. They're gonna check out all the awesome snakes they got. There's some really awesome folks that work down at Freedom Breeder and we're gonna go talk to some of them. It's another road trip. I love being on the road. If you guys watch the channel, you know that I love being on the road. If this is your first time watching the channel, what you gotta realize is that we do everything better every time than we did the time before including driving down the road. <laughs> oh, the bright sunlight can't stop us. How you guys feeling today? So seriously, you guys having a good one? I hope you're having a great one. Remember to leave a comment down below because we are now doing a little prize giveaway every time a video hits over 100 comments before the next video comes out. We're almost there, guys. Just around the corner now. Note to self, always set the camera to auto exposure when you're doing hands-free stuff. <laughs> yeah, we got big stuff. We use big stuff. Cause you know the thing is, when you're doing big things, you gotta use big stuff. And we're doing big things today. It's not necessarily about the size of the stuff, it's about how you use it. All right, we're gonna check out some snakes, but first let's go check out the people. Cause the snakes aren't going anywhere, but the people might. Coming for you. For what? Because. Magic stuff. Huh? <laughs> Say hey, Seuss! What's up? How long you work here, man? Uh, next month is gonna be 19 years. Next month's gonna be 19 years. Yeah. Dang, dude. See, this this guy's OG right here, man. <laughs> Are you putting together some racks? Yeah. Nice. Which is, uh, I have to double check him because somebody, I don't want to say who, but I'm looking at him, didn't bend him right. So you got your quality control. <laughs> <laughs> if it's not looking good, it doesn't get past you then, right? Negotiate the million dollar contract. All right, so w w this is Don. Don is the man. Don is in control. What are you in control of? All of that. All of that. He's in control of all the big stuff. You know, we were talking about big stuff. Don is the man in control of the big stuff. What else do you control? You're not just in control of the big stuff around here. You're in control of other stuff, right? You make sure that everybody everybody's funny? Well, I try to, but a lot of dry people here. A lot of dry people, yeah. yeah. A lot of dry humor floating around. I can, I can well, relate. Well, even without that. Even without, oh no, without the humor, still yeah. just dry in general. Yeah, it's very like, exciting here. What, what's your day looking like today, Ben? Mass production. Mass production. Usual. Big stuff. See, this is what we're talking about. The stuff gets big, and you have to contain it somehow. And that's that's another thing Don does. Is when things get huge, Don makes sure they don't get too huge. Is that weird? Yeah. <laughs> you should wait until we get the new machine. Where are you gonna put it? That's on Lindy. He'll figure it all out. It's his shop. For some reason, big, giant, huge machinery just blows me away. And the less I know about it, the more impressive it becomes. And as soon as I learn a little bit more about it, it becomes more normal, I guess. When you're discovering things like, oh, look at this new discovery. Oh, the Earth is round. Or oh, now again, now it's new. The Earth is flat. It's new. I think that's why this flat Earth thing is so huge right now. It's because it's new. It's a new thought all of a sudden. Get it in there. See what happens in here? Lindy leaves for a day, all of a sudden Jimmy's taking over. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's going on, Bubby? Okay, everybody loves Johnny Cash. So, I don't mean to put you on the spot. I'm just curious, you're the only girl that works here. I am. Is that, you are. How is that? Well, I grew up with all boys, so it's so you're used to it. And totally, this is to it. just just an extended family, is it? Totally. Yeah. Yeah. Well. And everyone's been here for years. Right. So we're definitely all family. Wait, look at that. She didn't even flinch. I want. I'm trying to make somebody flinch around here. Who's gonna flinch? Come on. <laughs> Oh, he didn't flinch either. Dang it. We are now behind the scenes of Freedom Breeder, like literally behind Freedom Breeder. Look, they got a huge pond back here. They haven't told me about this thing. I guess they had to build that for the fire code, but I, I wanted to come back here. Look at, what's, look at what these guys got going on back here, man. You got chickens? 
Did you know Freedom Breeder did chickens? I didn't. Let me tell you guys something. This is the worst time of day to be filming. The sun is like straight up, it's middle of the day. But you know what, whatever. Look at what else they've been hiding from me. Nobody told me there were tortoises back here. I'm gonna have to start asking all kinds of questions now. How fun is this walking through the trees though? <laughs> I feel like this is like awesome cinematic walk through the trees. All right, I don't care, I'm being ridiculous. I promised you guys some snakes, didn't I? Let's go check out the snakes. Is there somebody behind me? Tell me, is there some? I feel like I'm being followed. Jimmy says we've seen all the awesome snakes already. I'm here to prove him wrong. Yeah, they've seen everything. Well, how could we have possibly seen everything? This, this, we've seen, have you guys seen all of these snakes? I'm not saying that they're all like, yeah, we've seen them all already. No way, man, no way. I guarantee you there's at least one snake that we haven't seen yet. Possibly even two. Look, I don't think I've seen this one. Definitely not. Yeah, it's a highway, but I haven't seen this highway. You've seen highway, you just haven't seen that highway. Yeah, no. There's something on your head, buddy. You might have wanted it there. Oh, sorry, I took away your head, your head piece. Ain't nothing subpar about that snake. I'm just gonna stand back here and look at snakes, is that okay? Yeah. Oh, look at that! Jeez, this guy. That's a pastel lesser clown, and in my opinion, it is amazing! <laughs> this is just an ivory? For real? Yeah. No way. I guess that's just supposed to be straight up ivory, but man, does that look like just an ivory to you guys? I'm no expert. Oh, there's this. Potion scale his head. Mystic potion scale his head? These guys are in here just around. Oh, what? Come on, let's party. All right, it's time for party, you guys ready? Uh oh, uh oh. Why, why does anybody want to party with me? Oh, man. Why did I come in here to <laughs> show you? Spider potion uh -huh. scale his head. And it's paradox. You got no fire in here, Jimmy. Fire! It's a, it's a match. It's a match? Yeah, like a spark. <laughs> Some flint. Alright, Jimmy's been spending too much time in here. He's, everything, he's, he's, be, he's become underwhelmed. It's kind of like what happens to me, I guess, after I'm in here. I guess I should I should feel sympathetic, because every time I come in here, it's like, I get five minutes in, I'm like, okay, 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 give me a break already. Jimmy's in here all day, every day. I can, <laughs> <laughs> I can only imagine what that's like. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Orange Dream Super Inchy Spider. Holy bejeebus, Coral Glow, GHI, Super Spot Nose, Het Red Xanthic, Possible Cinnamon, Female Maker. Is that like a big explosion? Yeah, that was a big explosion. That's me doing a big explosion. Yeah, you don't think this is, that doesn't sound like a big explosion? Watch this. Yeah. Big explosion. This guy and his <laughs> underwhelmedness. You can be overwhelmed. Yeah, and, and you, you can, can be you underwhelmed. Can be, yeah, can you be just whelmed? Oh yeah, I get whelmed all the time. I got whelmed the other day. <laughs> Pastel, head red, exanthic, 100% head desert ghost. Wow. That head desert ghost, freaking, still trying to clean up, right? Yeah, it's pretty clean. Oh, Pinstripe oh, gravel. All right, Jeremy, three, three snakes. Three snakes, oh, uh, here's one. Oh my gosh, it's up high. How are you doing in the, oh my gosh. Super spot nose, yellow belly, GHI pastel. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, Jimmy, two more. Oh yeah, we gotta show an update on that. We showed this one right when it came out of the egg. Coral Glow and Chi Highway update. Hi, right, Jimmy. One more snake, dude. One more. This is the snake finale. The best you got. Tell me I had a bug these. on my face. I'll get it. That's oh, right here. <laughs> oh, you gotta hit it harder. Don't get the spider. Um, oh, there is a bug on your neck. <laughs> yeah, let's kill it. 
Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you should have. You almost gave me a black shit. eye. <laughs> what is that? Nah. Damn. You should have slow mode that next lap because his <laughs> cheek goes. It's not. There's nothing moving. <laughs> the second one. Hold on. Did. Hold on. I gotta really. I gotta. I gotta do a few of them. <laughs> <laughs> it expose it a little, expose yeah. it better, expose it. Break your head to the side. <laughs> Lean up. No, then it stretches the skin out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing work today? Got slapped in the neck a couple times. But no, no, no. <laughs> That's a them. Slap the Mexican. <laughs> It's a new game they're doing in school. It's, it's incredibly <laughs> racist, but they love it. So. It's all red back there. <sighs> Sorry. You didn't get taken out to dinner first. I feel bad for yeah. letting Jesse, Jimmy, having slapped Jesse, Jimmy, just for the sake of getting slow mo slap, so I'm gonna let him slap me back. Where are we gonna slap you at? Uh, my face. The face? Yeah. The glove well, on or glove on? Use the shit glove. I don't care. Okay. Nice and moist. I'm not at a good angle, though. What do you mean? We'll get at a good angle. Okay. Get into this one. <laughs> Hold on. Do I just see your face or him actually slapping you? I don't know. I like the whole thing, <laughs> we actually. Need, well, we, need the slow, we need to get a close-up on the face being slapped. So, okay. I mean... I'm ready. <laughs> That's how you get ready? Well, I'm trying to, get, I'm trying to be loose so it you makes... You slapped so off more. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a routine. I'm waiting. <laughs> it's all making me laugh. I'm wiggling the camera. Oh, <laughs> oh that kind of glanced. Alright, let me get a better one. Ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that was solid. Okay, okay better. Better? Alright. <laughs> <laughs> that was decent. That was decent. I think you do a little harder, though. Oh, sh. Oh, I better take over. <laughs> yeah, you got bigger mitts than I do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, we're getting stupid now. We gotta turn the camera off. We got slap happy. We need. We still need one more snake. Female calico orange dream coral glow possible yellow belly. Yeah. Wow. Oh, I'm not gonna say that one right now. Oh, you guys remember Nick? Nick watched me destroy myself with whiskey at Tinley. <laughs> sure did. Oh, I'm saying he ordered Ryan, another drink. Ryan, you're going anywhere, right? Oh, guaranteed. <laughs> See? Hey, my, my band used to. My, my band? Yeah, they used to quote me. They had one quote for me that they thought was like the most epic quote. Was, we were drunk as hell when I wrote Love to Hollywood and like, this is going to be. I don't know, it was crazy. It was crazy. Yeah. Right? And I, I was drunk. Sat right next to you, helped and me. And you and I are the only ones that built the racks. When they actually got there, Jesse was freaking out, stressed, and then he disappeared right when the rack showed up. <laughs> going to talk to people, and I, me and you sat there and built 20 racks in That's like right. an hour. We did. Yeah. Careful when you show up to a show and you stand at the Freedom Beater booth, and then the racks show up. Next thing you know, you're gonna be working the show. I did that with uh, Lindy. Uh, well, I just asked <laughs> Jesse. I said, so I wasn't at the show. Who built all the racks? And he goes, Oh, I did. I go, oh, Yeah, just like last time, huh, bro? You're lying there. Huh? <laughs> Wait, what's happening on here? <laughs> no, he says I'm lying. I said I was just trying to figure out who actually set the racks up hey, at the March show. Over there, telling wolf stories over there, huh? You telling stories, Nick? No, the only wolf in here is that dude with the same thing on his chin. <laughs> Jesse, Jesse, tell us, tell us what really happened, bro. What really happened? Oh man, you know I set Jesse, it all up, I'll tell man. You what happens? I clock with it. Jesse <laughs> freaks out until the racks get there. They're always late. Then no, they get man, there. There's full of Don't start. Don't so start. I like he's got important things to talk about. Hey, it's not my fault. Customers need information. <laughs> right when the racks show up, you yeah. just disappear and ghost out. That's usually when they all show up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm allergic to bullshit. I just started sneezing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When that happens, you know I set them all up. You can ask Jimmy; he knows. He Not pointed good. really good. No one, <laughs> no one points better than Jesse. Just, hey, somebody's um, got to be a supervisor. This is to be continued. We'll get to the bottom of what really happened. <laughs> You're in big trouble. Why? Well, we needed to. We need to. Uh, well, what we really came over here to find out is what's up with the bottle flies. 
I don't know what that is. <laughs> you don't know what that is? Mm -mm. I, I was told to ask you about bottle flies, that you would know everything, what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. I don't know. No? Mm -mm. Another mystery. Jim, Jim he, he, he had no idea what I was talking about with the bottle flies. I don't know what those are, but he looked, he looked a little suspicious, to be honest. It's how he pronounces butterflies. <laughs> what are you making fun of him for? <laughs> Jeez, this guy's so mean, guy. You guys know I would never make fun of anybody. Hey, Sue said uh, that I should ask you to show me your girdle. I don't know what he means by that. No? No. No? He seemed, he seemed pretty convinced that you would know what he was talking about. He might have been a little alcoholed. <laughs> alcoholed? Yeah. Maybe the heat from outside probably got to him. The heat from outside? You guys realize how hot it is in here? Oh my gosh. All right, apparently nobody knows anything about anything around here. <laughs> I know we're slapping each other around in there and stuff, but don't, that's specially reserved activity for very close friends and family, okay? Don't, don't be slapping people around without their express permission. We're not into uh, domestic violence around here. We're anti-domestic violence. Keep it in the workplace. <laughs> Rock and roll, folks. We're done here for the day, but not done for the day completely. We're gonna try and make it home in time to catch these boys and find out what they know. You guys ready to do this? Let's do this. Ah, just kidding. The sun is about to set. I stopped at this little rest stop here. So I am gonna get myself up in the air with my drone and ain't no better time to fly a drone than sunset. Let's go out You're in my mind I close my eyes So it's just you and I And I tell myself You'll be back again Stars are aligned, we will dance in the meadow on our favorite place when spring is coming. Good times. Now let's really get out of here. What the heck, you, you nakey, nakey boy? <laughs> what are you doing, you dippy dude? <laughs> hey, Missy Moo. What you been doing around these parts, huh? What you been doing up here? You been having some boo boo? Huh? You been having a little bit? Why? What you doing? How are you doing? Okay, so. huh? Are you having a little munch lunch? 
<laughs> I'm at much lunch. What is this disaster area of a garage I'm coming home to? What is going on in here? What is going on in the world? Somebody got some explaining to do. You playing with my tools and stuff, bud? Cutting. You playing what? with my tools? You, you can't just leave my tools all over the garage, ding dong. Ooh. All right, all right, you gotta put the tools away. Can you fix daddy's arm? No. With your tool. What if daddy's arm needs to be fixed? Okay. You're fixing my arm? daddy's hand. Okay. Hey, screaming. Hey, screaming. What? What do you know? I know. <laughs> it's just a mommy's holding baby sister. Mommy's holding baby sister? Yeah, that's yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Noah, what do you know? How about tomorrow indeed? Tomorrow's Saturday! We don't know things on Saturday! Before we head off to bed here, we did hit 100 comments, well, well over 100 comments on the last video, so we're gonna pull another name out of the hat and send off a prize. So thank you guys for jumping in and commenting. I hope you enjoyed the snake wrap. That was a lot of fun to make and a lot of fun to look back at and to laugh at. And I think a lot of people got a good laugh out of that. So that was well worth it. <laughs> if you plan on seeing more music videos here in the future, longer ones, different genres, we're going to get crazy up in this piece. You know what I'm saying? We, yeah, we're going to do it. We're going to do it well. And they're going to get better, believe it or not. So, so here's how we do this. So some of the other guys that are interested in doing this, you know, contest giveaway based on YouTube comments. You just grab and copy the URL for the video in question. Copy video URL. And you go over here to commentpicker.com slash youtube.html. And then you just go into this little box right here. You paste the link for the video. You click on that little button right there and it filters out the duplicate users, which I think is awesome, because even if people comment you know, a bunch of times, they only get one entry into the contest, which is fantastic that they worked out in this algorithm. So 111 commenters, let's start the raffle and pick a random winner. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Look at all those people go. Look at those names. Look at those names. Look at all the people. Who's gonna be? Who's gonna be? Winner is Synergy Paintball 81. And what did they have to say? Spits fire. Better than little Uzi Vert easily. Now I'm gonna have to check out who little Uzi Vert is. I did read this comment as I read all the comments you guys put, but I gotta admit I had never heard of little little Uzi Vert, so I'm gonna have to go give that a listen myself and see if, if my fire is indeed hotter than little Uzi Vert. Thanks, I'm taking that as a compliment. It very much seemed like a compliment. Synergy Paintball 81, please send me a message on Instagram, or Facebook, or an email. All the links are down in the description for all the ways to get a hold of me in private. And I will see you there. Hi right, guys, I hope you are doing something with your day that you enjoy, something that you love to do, and you're doing it with people that you enjoyed being around. Because hey man, life is short. You only got a little bit of time here on this earth, so you might as well make the best of it and do the best you can do with the best you can with all the things you were given by the good Lord Almighty and do what you you get the point do it right do it right you know what's right you know what's right in your heart do that yeah oh oh yeah get it oh I got it I got the spits I got those spits I got those spits I got those I got those I got the spits I got those spits I got the spits I got I got I got those spits I got those spits I got those spits I got I got I got those spits I got the spits Would you do that fancy dance? Would you do that fancy dance? Would you do it with your pants? Do that fancy dance? What are these people looking at us for? 